Okay. So yeah, we want Hector to go talk to him, so I'm gonna do that. With a nice dance. But yeah, we're gonna need to kill all these enemies. Osman can also recruit him, that's why Osman was over there, but I guess I should have used him a bit more efficiently, but well. And yeah, there we go. You. It can't be. Harkon? Oh. Hey, hang on, wait a moment. You're one of Freya's knights. Harkon, right? Lord Hector. You are one of Lord Elvet's sworn men, right? I heard all this all of his knights died on valor. Why don't you return a report to Elliwood? I failed in my duty to protect my sworn lord. I am not worthy of the honor of being a knight of Frey. Before Nurgle's magic we were annihilated. When Lord Elbert was taken away, I was powerless. That dog Nurgle. I heard he shared some connection with Black Fang. I searched the continent for signs of them. I intended to strike against them with my final breath. And now you're here. You can fight with us, Harkon. Elliot is here as well. Forgive me, Lord Hector. I would rather die a knight than live in shame. I will tra trade my life for many of theirs. Hold, Harkon. Do you think that's what Lord Elbert would ask for? I'm not from Frey, so it may not be my place to say, but Elliot would wait for you, for any of you to return. Well, Elliot? Elliot is in a war. If you're a true knight of Frey, you need to be at his side. I understand. My life is his. May it serve him better than it served his father. We got Harkon. So let's talk about him. Okay, first first off, those base stats. They are really, really, really good. And he has a Brave Sword too. The only one in the game, in fact. So recurring is actually kind of important if you want that weapon. Um, as a unit, he's basically like pre <laughs> pre Raven. Like, th this Raven's really good. But he compares extremely well on his own, and his strength is also really good too. I believe he capped it once when I used him too, so yeah. Even though he's a pre-promote, he can definitely get capped stats. <laughs> uh, he doesn't really have any issues too. I guess his weapon ranks could be higher, but they're in a good place. He can use the Brave Axe too. He can use Hand Axes just fine, because he has good stats. Um, and yeah, he's decently bulky too, with a barrier he can take on magic units, his defense is already pretty decent, and yeah, he should be one running most stuff, so yeah, Harkon is an amazing unit, and definitely the better of the two units to recruit. We'll see what the other unit is in the other playthrough of this map, but yeah, Harkon, if you're struggling, definitely consider using him. He's one of the <laughs> reasons why people really love the pre promotes in this game, because he's just so good. And I love using him too. Um, if I'm not like suit, I if either Raven's not performing very well, or I'm not using him. Then yeah, Harkin comes in to play. As for growth rates, he has 80% HP, 35 strength, 30 skill, 40 speed, 20 luck, 30 defense, and 25 res. So yeah, like I said, I love this unit. <laughs> and we can use Kanaz to kill this guy. And yeah, I'll talk about the other unit in the other map, like I said. But yeah, that unit, you need to open more than three doors, I think. Three or more doors, probably. Anyway, that's a decent level. Not amazing, but <laughs> it's something. And now we can use the Iron Bow to kill this guy. Because hey, I would like D-Rank. <laughs> you can use Steel Bow's pretty good then. And Lumbo's, actually. Anyway, Link can reach this guy, and this is where the Manicotti comes in. There we go. And now we can freely open doors because yeah, Harkin's the reason why we couldn't. So let's get to work on that. So we have Murnus too, who can give key keys to people, so we'll have to think about that. But remember there can be enemies in those, so make sure you have a decent amount of units. Like, decently strong units around this one. Anyway, <laughs> he keeps getting the stats I need him to. Also skill too, which is actually really good. So yeah, I'll have Raven here. We'll open this door next turn, I think. And Priscilla do it too. And yeah, Harkin could help out too. 
Alright, so Farron is a bit low, so I'm not going to go for the support this turn, instead I'm going to um, go for killing all these wyverns. <laughs> Yeah, good extension of Farana. And yeah, she's up really good. She's probably one of my favorite exclusive characters, to be honest. <laughs> and yeah, we can go for Fiora here. And then Florina takes out the last one. There you go. And yeah, all of my hair is now. Where Florian was joined at launch and she wasn't amazing. Her weapon's alright, but yeah, it's an old refine, so it doesn't compare to what new units are getting. Fiora has Pegasus Flight, which is a very rare skill that can be very interesting to use. And then Farana has her unique weapon that gets stronger effects if she has Dragon Flowers. So yeah, they're all really interesting heroes, even though they're all Lance Flowers. Because yeah, people like to complain about <laughs> people are not same yeah, using the same weapon type in heroes. It's actually like the very common ones like Lance Flyers, Lance Calves, Sword Infantries, Red Tome Mages, stuff like that. Anyway. I'm gonna have Priscilla Yeah, Priscilla can unlock this door. And inside, we have just two chests, very nice. So, any other gold can come and open them. And get a bolting, very nice. Um, I'll have Dart on this, wait on this door. Same with Raven and same with Kent. And we have some enemies here too, so we need to be careful with them. There are enemies in the next door, so we're gonna need to be careful with them. And yeah, the Farana is going to need some healing, so I can have Priscilla work on that. I'm going to have Odyssey go this way, have Bartra go this way. Merlinus, you can give some keys to Hawk. And yeah, that's all over that door. And yeah, the Brave Sword, I'm probably going to give it to Raven. Make Graven better at killing bosses, probably. And yeah, you can come along. I wonder where I want Lynn. If she's gonna promote potential on this map. The one near the start has axe units, so maybe the. And yeah, that's where the gold will go next. And we got a white gem, which is very much appreciated. Although, yeah, we can also use Priscilla because Priscilla uh, can just unlock the door. And the pegs are also good because they have swords for those axe units. So if I don't feel like using Lin, then we can do that. And yeah, Dart, Kent, they should be fine though. Yeah, like I said, uh, Harkin's gonna go open this, and then these units are gonna go inside and kill the enemies. And yeah, Merlin's did a good job there. <laughs> and yeah, I might have Link go kill these enemies. Later. So she can promote. And yeah, dance will be quite useful. But yeah, they can't gain another support, but they can work towards their next support. There we go. There's some treasure up. Woods, so 
I might have the gold go and get that first. <sighs> Actually, <laughs> we need the gold here too, so maybe we'll wait. Maybe I'll see if um, you have chest key as well. Anyway, Harkin's gonna go over this. We have a sniper. We actually have a lot of snipers. What levers do we have? Silver bow. Oh, he has a chest key. Cool. Poison bow, long bow, steel, steel. Okay. So, Kanash should be the one to kill this because he has a space in his inventory. So, yeah, I guess. <laughs> We don't need Legault to go upwards, he can go right then. Not so experienced on that guy, very nice. Now we got Chesky. And now I'm gonna have Botcher go ahead and use his bow. Okay, so yeah, things are looking good. And yeah, the enemies start moving when you open the door, so keep that in mind. Anyway, nice dodge. <laughs> this might actually give Bartra his D rank. Boom bows. Yeah, he's also level 10 now. He gains the fence, which is alright. There we go. <laughs> D rank. So you can use steel bows now, which I think I will do. And yeah, I'm gonna have him do have a bow war with these guys. You yeah, can use killer bows, that'll be funny, but I don't think we have any, so. <laughs> Alright, calves. I think they have real weapons. Axe Shiva, Axe Shiva, Lance Shiva, Lance Shiva, okay. Um, yeah, you can deal with them. Also, you don't get slowed down if you're in um, indoors, which makes sense. There we go. And yeah, I'm just training up his bow rank because it's funny. <laughs> we got a Talisman, which can be very nice. And there's, there's the only chest, so that's pretty cool. And yeah, like I said, I wanted Lin to get these kills, but yeah, with this, uh, with the weather changing, that's gonna be a bit more difficult. And yeah, I don't need a check for that chest key because, well, <laughs> uh, we already kind of have one up there, so that's good. So yeah, these next few turns are going to be very slow. The snow looks pretty cool. Like the snow effect. Anyway, Bartra... You might get level 11 here. Very nice. And there you go. Level 11 for Bartra. And more HE strip. Let's see if he caps those stats. That'd be quite cool if he can. Um, yeah, we'll have Bartra come along as well. In case he's useful. Nothing else ready to do. My weapons are gonna come slow towards us as well. Hey, this snow is lasting a bit. Okay, so you have an axe shiver, which is kind of annoying. Hey, you want the axe now? You already had your fun with the bow. And there goes the snow. Alright, so, uh, it's also kind of thing there's snow. There's no snow outside where I live at the moment, but it is definitely the winter time, so. Alright, so let's start killing some enemies. Yeah, you have a Lance Shiva saying go bye bye. <laughs> and yeah, he's not getting much experience because yeah, he's quite high level. So we'll put Kanas instead. And yeah, Kanas can even heal. He's going to be out of flux though, hopefully I have some in the convoy. Otherwise it's going to be quite a lot harder to fight with Kanos, but anyway. I'm going to 
put Lin here, I'm gonna put Hector here, and then next time we'll open the door. That's how we'll do it. Lin might also be able to kill those. Actually, I'm gonna have, um... I have the pegs work on them. And once again, we'll use Farina. Because she's awesome. Okay, so yeah, we'll have some action next time, which is nice. Hey, you got hit. Nice crit. There we go. And yeah, can also also levels up. I am... Um, notice... I am uh, going back to us about the conditions too. I didn't mention Lucius, he counts because he needs a guiding ring. And Kanas doesn't though, because he's in a Gaida map, so it doesn't count. So... <laughs> so if you want to train up a mage unit, but want, still want to go to this map, then yeah, Kanas is a good idea. Anyway, no more Flux. Hopefully there's still some Flux in the convoy, otherwise, yeah, like I said, it's going to be hard to use them. Anyway, Farina dodges. She has a good crit rate, but yeah, we'll see if it actually procs. There we go. Very nice. Another kill on the Wyvern Lord. Alright, so now you're gonna open the door. And yeah, we got these enemies. And yeah, she doesn't die, which is good. She can use the money quite useful. I'll put Hector here. Uh, <laughs> it's still a bit risky though. At least these guys don't hit. And yeah, guys, boys max. So, hmm, I wonder if there's a way to give her a better weapon. Probably not, but. Yeah, let's just wait here. That's the plan we'll do. And now we want Farina to kill this one, and then yeah, we can still keep supporting. They might also go for... Those Hanax dudes might also go for the pecs. So yeah, there's that as well. Yeah, another good level up. She has a lot of strength, which is very nice. You do have a bow, which uh, could be bad. Um, Florina can take this one. Oh, that. Okay, so yeah, they can't. Sh so yeah, we can't do the uh, support this time, unless I want to live life on the edge. Hey, I can jab on this guy. So that's pretty cool. At least one of them will be able to support, so... Yeah. So those enemies are gone now. The Gulk can now open this. And we got some... We got a hero in here. I have a Sword Reaper. Yeah. So yeah, you can eat that. <laughs> there you go. Easy PC. And the rest of our units can go for um, the others. So yeah, Raven can go for one, and then. Yeah, the primary enemies seem to have Thor keys. But yeah. <laughs> We're actually gonna be using the Steel Axe here. Oddly enough. And there we go. <laughs> yeah, Steel Axe isn't death. Definitely not Raven's weapon of choice. And yeah, he still doubles this. Awesome. Nice on Kent. Yeah, this stuff will be a two-parter map, as I was anticipating. Alright, so yeah, let's see what Lin does. If she dies, I'm gonna be very sad. <laughs> 
Yeah, so that guy might go for his bow, which would be very smart on his part. And yeah, you're out of flux at the moment, so yeah. I'll keep him around here. In fact, I'll keep these two around here. Arga still has the Dorkies, so... But yeah, you have zero hit, which is good. I don't think they can kill them, because, yeah, like I said, zero hit. With some of these guys. Yeah, level 19. Speed and luck, very nice. You have the hand axe, still doesn't hit. And then the other guy's probably gonna go for his bow. Yep. But now you can't counter, so that's good. He's gonna need to be weakened a little bit. Ah, oh, nice. <laughs> More enemies there. Um, but we do have a Priscilla. Who can do that? So I can do that. And then... Link can... Kill you now. Very nice. And then we can dance for her and kill the brigand. We got Dorky, of course. Yes, like I said, I think most of the promoted enemies have them. Dance for Lin. And now, this might actually be promotion. There we go. Cheap. I probably should have given her a killing edge, to be honest, but... Anyway, there it is, level 20. Stats look actually really good, except for the defenses, but anyway. <laughs> As I'll keep saying. And yeah, Hector, he can stay around. But yeah, I'm actually gonna use... Um, we're gonna use Dart to kill those Armonites. But yeah, now I have to use Luna or... Uh, Rotten, and you can see the problem here. They weigh a lot. At least he doubles Luna with one of these guys. Maybe. I'll have to go for the challenge here. Because, yeah, these enemies don't have very good rows, so. I can do that and potentially get more experience. I might do that. It doesn't work out, but we can have Bart track with the bow and that'll be all good. There we go. <laughs> and yeah, Harkin, he's gonna open the door for us, like I keep saying. Yeah, you go in the forest, which is kind of annoying. He has an axe shiva, so yeah, the bow is actually the bird bet if I want to use Bartra. Anyway, let's try to promote them. And yeah, she's gonna be a lot better now. Yeah, she's a blade lord. And it gives her extra bulk, which is very appreciated. And she gets bows, which is okay. <laughs> but yeah, her stats are a lot better now. And yeah, it's actually deep bows, so... Long bows... And steel bows. And she gets some interesting animations too. <laughs> Yeah, I wasn't expecting me to get Limp promoted at this point, but I'm happy with that. And yeah, she also has 6 roof now, which is very nice. And yeah, Pex might also be useful for what's coming up. Maybe Iron Axe. Axe Reaver? Oh, <laughs> an Axe Reaver. Well, that wasn't great. 
Oh well. You're here, so you can hop out. And yeah, that, that place has treasure, so... There's four treasure chests in total. And yeah, like I said, Knoss probably needs this experience, so I'm gonna go for it. And there's the crit from the Luna. There you go. Yeah, level 7. And <laughs> more magic. So he does 20 damage to the loot now. Which is pretty good. Um, but of course, it's very hard to double with Luna, so. Because it weighs a lot. Anyway, let's see how he does against these Axe Shivers. As predicted, not very well. But he hits one of them, so that's good. I need the sword driver. And it's snowing again. But this might be the last time it does. Anyway, I kinda wish I had a uh a sword reaver on you, but that's okay. Because yeah, we have a boss in there, so I'm gonna wait for it to stop snowing and then we're gonna go for it. That's gonna be the plan. And yeah, Oswin's probably gonna be very good again. And the boss will be interesting to talk about. Uh, let's see, say a uh, Sword Reaver. Let's go for it. There you go. And yeah, Kent can kill the other guy with his sword. Alright. And then we need to get Legault in there. He doesn't kill that, it's okay. There you go. Very, very nice. So yeah, <laughs> this map went pretty smooth, I'd say. Well, we haven't fought the boss yet, which is a bit... He's a bit of a nuisance, so... And yeah, I don't really, I don't know if all of my units out there can take him on. I guess Oswin definitely can, so... And again, I put away a silver once for a boss, which, yeah, not the greatest, but... Oh well. And yeah, who knows, maybe Link could do something. But yeah, promote Lin will be nice for mats where we need her. Doing stuff. Anyway, you can open this. We have a Axe Shiva Hand Axe Dude. And these guys have a Javelin and a Kill Lads. Alright. So, a yeah, Sword Reaver, once again, is pretty good. But you do hit us, so I might not use Dart for the other two. But, another nice start level up. And this time he doesn't get strength and speed. <laughs> Just strength. And we got another door key. Stats are looking very good. Raven will probably be my number one choice. <laughs> Let's kill once. He might actually move towards us, which is fine by me. But yeah, before I open that door, actually, I also want to get the chest. Just in case. Well, the chest. It's singular. <laughs> Alright, yep, you move. And the snow's gone. So, yeah, like I said, let's do this first. So, let's see. Uh, <laughs> I can definitely just hand axe. And not have to worry. There we go. <laughs> Got a little extra experience with dot. And then maybe can on this guy with the steel, yeah. Easy peasy. 
But yeah, at least I'll have some things to talk about with the boss because yeah, he's interesting. <laughs> And yeah, I was saying for lost just because treasure. <laughs> the only three enemies left and they're all inside the boss's room. And we have more units to help out too, so that's nice. Uh... And who knows, maybe these girls have support. We'll see next map, but I'm probably not gonna... <laughs> it's gonna be hard to trigger it next map because it's a hard one. One of the hardest maps in the game, in fact. So... They also want Ninion up there, so... I'll rescue Dropper with Priscilla. So I'll do that. And you're just gonna go get that. Uh... Yeah, we don't have a lot of units. <laughs> get this. It's a hero crest. So yeah. You only get that if you go to this map, which makes sense because yeah, if you're training up hero crest users, then you're gonna need more hero crest basically. So <laughs> anyway, that's not who opens the door. It's gonna be Harkin. And yeah, here's the boss Germ. He has a light brand. He even drops it too. Um, he's an assassin. Trained killers who can deal death in a single blow. If they get a crit, there's a 50% chance that their silencer skill will proc, which uh, causes instant death, so yeah. And yeah, like I said, I kind of wish I had a sword reaver, but he does pretty good on his own. He one runs with the bow, the iron bow, so you know what, let's do it. Yeah, I'll chop you all up into tiny little pieces. And yeah, the reason why he's a light brand, it can't crit at range, and that's what he's gonna mostly go for, so then he can't unfairly kill you basically. Gwa! It hurts these cuts. And we got another light brand which might be useful for them. <laughs> that's the only unit who really needs them, because you don't want to use a light brand over a hand axe or javelin. Anyway, so Kanas. Yeah, this is the problem with him only having Luna. I think these guys have launch reavers. Yeah, they do, so I'm gonna take advantage. So I guess you can go for Nosferatu, maybe that one shot. <laughs> anyway, more speed, that's pretty cool. More defense is also really cool. And only a single enemy remains. And yeah, Nosferatu is a one shot. And there we go. Map over. And we got all the chests too, very nice. Everyone is being driven mad by Nurgle. It must be terrifying to lose yourself entirely, to fall completely on the sway of Nurgle's power. Hey, what could this be? It can't be the farmer? So this madman had it all along. Let's take it and go. We've finally gone it back. Let's not waste our good fortune. Hollywood, there's no reason for us to stay any longer. I know. Let's make case for the mats. We must stop the assassination. You can't let the prince's life be put into jeopardy. You know your role, yes? The plan must be carried out tonight. Mother, just once. If only for a little while. May I hold your hand? Nino, you know how I abhor such displays. I know. But I may not get another chance, and I thought... Very well. Huh? If you complete this mission, I'll hold your hand as often as you like. I'll even hug you and stroke your face. Oh really? Then I must do my best. I will. I will. I will succeed. Wait for me, mother. I will. Be careful. 
Alright, I'll be back. Ah, Jafar, wait here for a moment. It's about tonight's mission. What is it? Once you've killed the prince, kill Nino too. What? The assassinations. Both come directly by the king's request. The prince is well loved, and his death will trigger much chaos. If the assassin is not caught and hanged immediately, the chaos will engulf burn. A scapegoat is needed. Do you understand? Nino is your daughter. She is trash, garbage, human refuse. I'm just happy at last I have found a use for her. She did say she would do anything to please her loving mother, did she not? Her death will please me more than her living ever did. What is it? Do you have something to say? This has nothing to do with me. When Lord Nurgle found you as an orphan, he chose you because of your callous heart and your skill with a blade. Lord Nurgle does not give second chances, do not forget. Oswin, Lord Hector, have you heard anything from my brother? When you say anything, come, you know, about his condition? No, nothing new. I see, that's good. Why do you ask? No reason, really. I'm simply concerned for my brother. Earlier, when I saw him in Ostia, he didn't look well. When father took ill and died, I wonder if he looked at all like that. Forget it, I'm worrying about nothing. If something were wrong, I'm sure we would have heard. Yes, indeed. Now that you mention it, I did forget something. Lord Ufa sent word to you through a messenger. Oh, what did he have to say? Don't trouble Lord Elliwood by being overly obstinate. Just like my brother, always the same thing. How many times have I told him to stop treating me like a child? Anyway, so this like plot with Sonya is gonna reach its natural cause in the next map. But we'd still have the other version of Pale Fire Darkness, and that'll be the next map I record and put on the channel. So yeah. <laughs> next time will be the other version of Pale Fire Darkness, and the one that most people prefer because like I was kinda of mentioning earlier, um it's a seize, so it can be beaten a bit quicker, I think. And also show off the other character you can recruit. Because, uh, might as well. Because I am playing the map um, again, so now will be a good opportunity to do so. Anyway, we'll talk about the differences there, so yeah. Anyway, I'll see you guys again for that.